Hello all you beautiful people, how are you doing today? This is Lava Temptress and welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, welcome, hi! Today we're playing some more Walking Dead episode 4. We just got to the school and we gotta go see if we can find some batteries. Must be the guy who ran this place. Keeping Looks you like safe? himself as some kind of supreme leader. I don't think he kept him too safe, huh? No children. Wow. They're rules, man. Crappy, crappy rules. Let's look at some of the... The alleyway to the auto shops down here. You coming or not? Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. Alright, so we don't want to look at the door. Other oh, shell casings. Shell casings all over. Whatever happened here wasn't good. I wonder if we could use them for anything. I've already been fired. They're worthless. Then why did you want me to pick them up? Should we look at the bloody locker? Logan. It looks like a child's hand print. Handprint. Can't open it without the combination. Hmm. Hey, okay, here's the fire escape. Oh, I thought maybe there'd be something I could this take. Must be the door to the alleyway where the auto shop is. But where the hell is Molly? Yep, here's the stairs. Molly, you out here? I don't know, there's something fishy about her. I'm going that way. I think she was here longer than what she said. Oh, fence there, so we have to go this way. Deliveries made in rear. No deliveries right now. Authorized Auto motor pool workers only. What did that say? Looters will be shot on sight. Uh, did you see that? That somebody just ran past. Damn. Hmm. Photo ID required beyond this point. Why? That's weird. I guess we're climbing up the shelf, huh? This must be the garage we need to go in. the entrance to that auto shop where Bree said we'd find that battery. All right, let's try to open it. Nope, Damn. that's not budging. It's jammed tight. Hmm. Okay, so what else can we do? Nothing here. Yeah, I don't think we want to go over there. Yeah, that fence is already messed up. They might be able to break through that. That wouldn't be good. Hmm. Oh, what the heck? Where did that Leave come from? Him. He's mine. Uh, what are you doing? What were you doing up there? Um, I have a feeling she knew this guy. Molly? She's, she's pretty pissed. Molly! What the what? heck happened? Uh, what the hell, Molly? What the hell do you think you're doing? It's dead already. I think you can lay off. Don't tell me what to do. You kill geeks your way, I'll kill him mine. Damn. We gotta smash He's the brain. Medical scrubs. Some kind of scientist or doctor, maybe? Yeah, well, he ain't shit now. <sighs> she gonna tell us what's up? Million. Yeah, but the garage door's jammed. Can't raise it.
Not a problem. Look what I found. Oh, nice, right the Jack. That'll work. Oh, no. That fence isn't going to hold up. Come on. Oh, crap. Go, 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 go. I'll take it out. Take it out. Yeah, you didn't kill him all the way. What the hell? Take a look around. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. All right. Looks like Crawford had their own semi trucks. Yeah, what would they need that for? Well, I can see where the battery should be, but it's not. Perfect. All right, so what about here? That blinking must be an anti-theft system. Good chance of a working battery being in that car. If I can find a way to get up there. Um, it okay, so... Like it's the holes for the lift hydraulics. No power. Okay, so... Let's see, we don't want to go out the door. At least I don't think so. More of Crawford's rules. How did anybody live like this? One quart of oil for every three months. Hmm. Good chance of a working battery being in that car. If I can find a way to get up there. All right. Um. Okay, is there a way to hook up a battery here? Don't think I can pry that hose apart with just my hands. Maybe if I had something to cut it with. Okay, so we're looking for something to cut. Can we go... Oh, yeah, ask her. Doesn't she have her tool? Something you need? Uh, about that walker in the alley. What was all that about back there? He came at me up on that rooftop. Tried to take a bite out of me, so I took care of business. What, no, me killing geeks? I don't no, think so. It just seemed like you went to town on him a little more than you needed to. Uh -huh. Hey, you never really know when those things are all the way dead. I was just making sure. Look, you want to get this battery or not? Time's wasting. Uh, so Crawford. What do you think happened to Crawford? Don't know, don't care. As far as I'm concerned, these fuckers got what was coming to them. Not a lot of sympathy for all the people who died here, huh? No. I have about as much for them as they did for the sick and the old and anyone else they didn't think was fit to belong in their little paradise. So yeah, fuck them. Okay, can I borrow your hook? Borrow that uh, hook thing of yours? I don't know. Hilda and I have been through a lot together. Hilda? That's what <laughs> I call her. Don't judge. Please, can I borrow Hilda? I'll take good care of her. She won't get a scratch. There was another one in I the front, too. I wonder now. if we can grab it. Scratch. All right, so let's go back here. Oh, I see. So if it drains it, it'll lower the car. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, shit. That's probably not good. No shit. Oh no. I'll try to hold him off. Hurry. There's the battery. Finally something goes right. Hurry. It's off. All right, let's get this battery out. Got that one off. Got, got the it. battery. Yeah, but we still got a problem here. Put it in here. I'll carry it. Okay, follow me. Move your ass! Where are we going? Oh, 
Um. Great. Now what? Skylight. It's shut. Shoot it out. I need me one of those. She's pretty strong, I gotta say. To be able to pull herself up that quick and him. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. Okay, but how am I supposed to get Come over? Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump! Uh... I don't know. No, no, man. Oh, shit! Well, I, I didn't grab her hand fast enough. Let's okay. try that again! Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump! Uh, I don't know. I don't know, man. I grabbed her hand! Oh my god. Maybe third time's the charm? Okay. Uh. Now we're on a roof. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. No, because you won't grab my freaking hand, man. Okay, this Come time on, we're gonna say I can't. Chicken? Jump! I can't. It's too far. <gasps> See, I grabbed her hand. What the hell? <sighs> okay, so now we're on a roof. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. Okay, if I don't make it this time, I'll pause until we make it. I just don't understand. I I clicked it right away. Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump. Uh. I don't know, man. There we go. Apparently, fourth time was the charm. All right, we're looking back at the school locker, so I guess that's a good thing. Oh yeah, cause the tree. We could probably just come down this way. Come on. Yeah. Later. Something I gotta do first. What? Catch you later. Wait, you still got the battery? Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. See you back in class. Molly. God damn it! What the hell is she doing? Wow. Well, okay, so let's look around because. What are they doing? You guys need any help? Thanks, but I think we're almost in. We're taking care of it, Lee. Don't worry. Alright, whatever. Didn't want to help you anyway. Little help! Little help here! Oh, God. <laughs> won't close all the way. Lee, do something! We got it. Break the door with something! Close, 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 close! Alright, we got it. Take that hold? I don't know how long that'll hold, though. There. There's so many of them. Got the fuel. Let's not start high fiving each other just yet. Let's get the hell back to the classroom. Give us a hand with these fuel cans. They weigh a goddamn ton. That glass sounded like it was cracking. That is not good. You're back. Yeah, and we made out pretty good too. Great work, Kenny. How you doing with that door? Not so good. Here, let me give you a hand. 
Did you get that battery yet? Yeah, Molly has it. She should be back here soon. She'd better be. Right? Bree? Hey, Lee. Thanks for all your help back there. I don't think we would have made it without you. No problem. We're all on the same team. Well, at least I think we are. Uh, how long have you known Vernon? How long have you known Vernon? Couple of years. He ran our support group. He was really great helping me come to terms with my disease. But how do you come to terms with something like this? With a place like Crawford? I don't right? know what I or, or the other survivors would have done without Vernon. He's the one who held us together. Kept us alive. Uh, about Crawford. What do you think about this whole Crawford situation? I'd rather not talk about it. Too many awful memories. Even being back here gives me a bad feeling. Even now, with everyone dead? I got no sympathy for what happened to these people. They weeded out the sick and the old. Even children. Those least They'd... able to defend themselves so that they could save their own skins. Whatever happened here, however Crawford fell, I consider it poetic justice. Damn, girl, that's cold. That How is kind of cold. If you'd seen what I seen, you'd feel the same. Probably. Uh, so you're so a cancer, you're a cancer survivor? survivor? Like Vernon and the others? Yeah, I was diagnosed when I was in college. Been getting treatment ever since. Just when I was starting to get better, when I thought there might be some hope, all this happened. That would Lost suck so family. bad. I'm the only one who survived. Funny how things work out, huh? So I survived cancer, but, I'm a you know, busy here, apocalypse! Lee. Maybe you should go get that battery or help with the medicine. What, why is she busy? Um, what are we looking at? Hopscotch. Uh, okay. That was kind of pointless. Why, why was that a thing? Okay, Clem. Yeah. This desk is just like the ones we have in my school. I know it's weird, but I kind of miss it. Poor Clem. I know I say it a lot, but poor Clem. Uh, I miss Me teaching. Too. I used to be a teacher, remember? Tell you what, when we find ourselves a safe place, set up a little classroom. Just you and me. That'd be cool. Will there be homework? No <laughs> homework. I should Where's learn Molly? if there's no homework. She had to go run an errand. She'll be back soon. I hope she's okay. She'll be fine. She's pretty tough. Right? Do you think things will ever be normal again? Just like the way they were before? Uh, no. Uh, I don't think so. I don't think so, Clem. I think the best we can hope for is that we'll find a way to survive, to stay together, and to not let this change us. That's what's important. I guess you're right. Yep, everything's gonna be different. This is definitely not gonna change. Okay, so what is this? A paste? Just a bunch of paste. A globe? I have to wonder what's going on in the rest of the world. Right? If there's not a way to communicate with them. What do we still need? We already got the fuel and the battery. Once we find some medicine, we'll be good to go. So where's this battery you found? Molly has it. She ran off to do something. Well, she'd better bring it back here. I don't know why you trusted that girl with it. We hardly know her. That she girl, the way he said she... that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but what has she done for me lately? What have you done for me no, lately? Wait. There is something you can help me with. I do. Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. What? What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. He's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ben, come on. This oh again? god, if you tell him the truth right now, he might kill you. If I yeah, he... screwed up back at the motor and they'd still be alive. How he might kill you if you tell him that. I, I mean, oh my goodness. Uh, are you fucking nuts? Ben, no offense, but have you lost your motherfucking mind? Can exactly. He on? You tell him you're to blame? I don't even want to think about what he might do. I know. Exactly. I about that, but I don't know how much longer I can keep looking him in the eye. I feel like I'm lying to him by not telling I'm him. I'm telling you, man, it's a bad idea. Real, real bad. Hey, maybe you're okay walking around with somebody's blood on your hands, but that's not who I am. 
I can't just pretend it never happened. Well, you're Look, the one that did we it. Need Kenny. We need him to hold his shit together if we're ever gonna get out of here. So you need to keep this to yourself. For the good of everyone. You hear me? I hear you. I'm gonna get back to this. I'm not liking Ben so much, let me tell you. Alright, no TV. Crowd, no TV. There are books to read, though. Come back for these later. Any reading material would be nice once we get on that boat. Right? Oh, Clem might like one of the dolls. Creepy. Uh, never mind. They're, they are very, very creepy. Um... What are we doing while we're waiting? Oh, what's on the desk? Pamphlets. Oh, it's Looks the like numbers. What does it mean? Crawford's final solution. Initials of person searching term. Days since outbreak. Numbers of walkers found. Number of ineligible citizens found. Number of citizens brought to Crawford. Oh, okay. That's interesting. Anything else in here? No? The Georgia State flag. A lot of history there. Not that it matters much now, I guess. Right? So according to Bree, fuel is at the maintenance shed. Medicine might be at the nurse's office. And a battery would probably be at the auto shop out through here. Then why are you saying that if we already got some of it? I, I, I don't know. Wonder if they need our help with the medicine. And they should probably know that there's walkers over here. What's the hold up with the medicine? Oh shit! How'd they get in there? Kristen Vernon must be trapped in there. No, if I, you really want me to? Yeah, they're gonna all come after me. What the fuck? the hell happened? They wandered into the hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. What about the mids? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. Looks like they were keeping all the prescription meds in that safe. Locked up tight. Uh, can we bust no it open? We can bust it open? Maybe with enough time, but I don't know how much of that we have. Be yeah, that's a true. Lot quicker if we just knew the four-digit combination. Well, I doubt they just wrote it down and left it here for us to find. We should just try busting it open. We don't have any other choice. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. Yeah, what if we can find the combination? I'll have to take time to rest later, I think. Wasn't looking to rest. What is this? A copy machine. Not that it matters with no power around here. Just a bunch of papers. No safe combination, though. Darn. Thought maybe it'd be easy. Phones probably haven't worked in months. Looks like some kind of medical file. Oh, no, no, no. I, I didn't mean to go out there. Not working. Okay, what else? Somebody was taping something. No tape inside. What's this on the floor? Aw, somebody was it's pregnant. Looks pretty sturdy. No way we're gonna force that open. We might be able to find something to pry it open, but it'll take time. We don't have time. Omid needs that medicine. 
We have to get it open now. Well, let's see if we can find the code before I have to shoot it open. Y'all already checked these drawers? Yes, Lee. Nothing in there worth taking. <laughs> already cleaned out. There's dried blood on this printout. And on the floor. Looks like a trail of it from the safe to the camera over there. Then out the door. Hmm. What the hell happened here? Alright, anything else? No. Alright, well, I guess we're gonna have to shoot it open. Do you think shooting it open would work? Only thing that would accomplish is getting us all killed. So, yeah. no, I don't. Hey, Krista. What's... Yeah. Uh, making progress? Are you making any progress with the safe? No. Without the combination, I don't know how we're gonna get this damn thing open. If we don't get back to Omid with some medicine soon... It's okay. We'll figure it out. Uh, are you feeling, are you feeling okay? okay? I'm fine. Why are you asking me that? It's just that you've been looking a little pale the past couple of days. You've been throwing up... Oh, you... come on! You just dug up a rotting dog carcass! I'm surprised we weren't all throwing up. Lee, I'm fine. Quit Is she pregnant? Me, okay? Worry about Omid. We've got to get him these meds. I think she's pregnant. I hope I did the right thing bringing Clementine with us. This place isn't exactly safe. Then why did you? Because leaving her alone with Omi didn't seem any safer. What's that supposed to mean? Well, well if he dies... Omid's pretty sick. If he dies with Clementine alone in the house with That is Exactly. Not Do you hear me? That is not going to happen. That's why I brought her. To Omid, and he's going to be fine. He's going to be fine. You're right. I'm sorry. Look, Lee, I just want to get back to Omid. Let me do my thing, all right? Okay. I think she's pregnant. I thought that, uh, I forget what happened, but I thought that a little bit ago. How's it coming? Slow. Too slow. I'm worried that by the time we manage to get this thing open, it may be too late. Uh, about the Molly. help me get the battery we needed. That's great. One down. Where is she? She took off. Had some kind of errand she needed to run. Took off? With the battery? Yeah. Don't worry. She'll be back. I hope so. That girl doesn't really strike me as a team player. More right? More mercenary kind. Alright, about me. How much me. time do you think Omid has, Doc? You want my medical opinion? The sooner we get him some strong antibiotics to start fighting that infection, the better. Let's just leave it at that, huh? Uh, thank hey, you for coming. Doctor, I just wanted to thank you for coming with us. And for yeah. Help. I really appreciate it. Don't mention it. It's times like these we've got to help each other the most, right? And we're no better than those Crawford sons of bitches. That's right. I heard that. I'll go see if I can find something that'll help us get that safe open. Good idea. All right, so I guess we're going to have to go out in the hallway. And we're going to have to... No, let's see if we can find the code. Let, let's just keep going. Because cause I want to. Alright, trying to see if there's anything on the ground or... Uh, still can't get that. Why? Right. Did the photo the same? Must be the guy who ran this place. Live within the it's race. Like he what? Himself as some kind of supreme leader. All right. Not that I want to. I wasn't going for the bathroom. I was hoping maybe we'd find some clue or something. Been a long Does time the... since I had to use one this small. Does it work? All right. I don't know where we're gonna find this code.
Let's see if they have any clue or... Um... Hey, I... I'm a little busy here, Lee. Maybe you should go get that battery or help with the medicine. Dude. Okay, I didn't know if there'd be like some code on my... Trying! Let's see if they have anything. How are you guys doing with that door? Slower than I'd like. Don't worry, we'll get it open. I think. Alright, so that's not helpful. What, there wasn't a code on here, was there? Uh, initials of purchasing, conducting search. 71 OB. Oh, day since outbreak. Okay. Hmm. See, I don't see anything else. So how are we going to... Nothing but crayons and construction paper. Okay, does this give us a clue? So I don't see any fuel is at the maintenance shed. Medicine might be at the nurse's office, and a battery would probably be at the auto shop out through here. Hmm, I don't see a code anywhere. And there was nothing over there. Well, and would the code have anything to do with like rules or something hmm sounds like there's a shit ton of walkers out there yep Okay, right, where am I gonna find this damn code? Okay, I can't search any of their bodies. Wonder if I missed it in the nurse's office. Wonder if it's in the medical file. Anna Correa. Guess she must have been a patient here. And what's this? 82 days after outbreak, right? Alright, so let's play it on here, see if this will give us a clue. Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547, Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh God, oh God, oh God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. Wow. Maybe a It'll make the procedure easier on you. Wait, wait, wait. I want the procedure. I want my baby. I can't He's putting do in the code. I can't do this. Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow, or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. That is wrong. Well, it looked like he was going to hit four. Damn it, we almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We got to keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Maybe you should search him. See what he's got on him. 
Ah, that's a good idea. Okay. Oh, there was lots of walkers out where he was, though. Damn it. Well, this is going to be a pain. All right, so we're going to have to leave it right there, and we will come back next time. But damn, now we're going to have to go search that body, and I know there's a lot of walkers out there, so ooh, I'm not looking forward to that. But if you enjoyed it, make sure, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. And until next time, this is Love Attemptress. Don't get burned. Bye!